All right, here we are for the next one. Uh, this one here, it's a green piece of paper, but my phone looks blue. Hmm, interesting. Uh, I have my full rectangle again, right? And I have my base and I have my height. Or if I just move it up like this, I have my base and my height, the same colors. Uh, what I've done is I've taken a point on this edge, on that side, and I've divvied it up into three sections. And as you can see, I now not have two like my right triangles, but I have three triangles. These three triangles, um, if you look at my main triangle here, it has three angles that are less than 90 degrees, therefore it is an acute triangle. So if you remember from the last video, I said it was really important that we have to make sure our base and our height, our base and the height always meets at 90 degrees. And what we'll do is, I'll just show you this 90 degrees in this corner, 90 degrees, okay? And that's the same with this one over here, 90 degrees. Ooh, that's a terrible corner, 90 degrees. Okay, um, to prove that this triangle here, this triangle here is still half of this entire rectangle, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my entire area, I'll take these two bits off, and all I'm going to do is I'm just going to rotate them. Okay, I'm going to rotate so that this, this top is going to match up with my bottom. So as I rotate here, I'm going to go like that, and as I rotate here, I'm going to go like that, and I'm going to now just put them together. As I put them together, we can see that I have one triangle. And of course, this triangle plus this triangle is the whole rectangle. And so I have two equal parts, two equal parts, which means this is half of the triangle. And, or sorry, half of the rectangle. And what's really important to see here is that, has my base changed at all? No, my, my base hasn't changed because my base at the top here has come down to base at the bottom, right? So if I rotate that around, my base hasn't changed. Okay, base stays the same. And how about that, that height? Remember the base and height meets in the corner? So base and height, they're always at 90 degrees. So when I rotate this, I come into side here and my base and height, my base is the same and the height is the height of the triangle. And the height of the triangle has to meet at 90 degrees. Okay, so it's really important that we remember that the side of the triangle is not the same as the height of the triangle. That's really, really important. The height of the triangle is different than the side of the triangle. All right? Uh, the next video is going to be on the obtuse scaling, and it's really important to remember this 90 degrees and the difference between height and side when we get to that last one. I'll catch you there.